what it is gang what it do squad what's poppin a smob it's your girl jasmine and i'm coming at you with another banger Today, I'm showing y'all my skincare routine. If my skin looks really oily, it's because I just got done doing my skincare routine. So, um, stay tuned for the video. Okay. Y'all ask for it. Oh, my God. I forgot. Y'all, we reached 1K. I told y'all once we reach 1K, I'm going to show y'all my skincare routine. So, that's why I'm dropping it. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. I just want to say it's been a long time coming. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Yo, okay, but thank you guys. Make sure y'all watch that video. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe if you want to. So, okay, bye guys. <laughs> so, first, I'll start with a deep clearing. Um, Freeman mask, whatever y'all. I don't know. I'm bad at this. But the face mask was really cold. It was so cold, like ice cold. So like basically this mask is a really good mask that I use for my face because it clears up those acne marks and then it doesn't leave my face like super duper dehydrated. And it's not uncomfortable on my face. You can literally sleep with this mask on your face and your skin would be perfectly fine. Like Freeman masks are just it's like they don't do too much but they don't do too less when they make their face mask you know what i'm saying y'all should really sponsor me because you know i fuss with y'all oh my bad i'm not supposed to be cursing it my bad okay but i let this sit for about 15 minutes. 15 minutes later okay so then next i use my favorite sensitive skin uh dove soap it has like no scent to it that's the best soap to use soap with no scent so i let that lather up in my uh free my hands before i put it on my face and i also use cold water when i'm rinsing my face off i never ever use warm water and what y'all see is a face exfoliator i use it for my skin well just for my face i don't know why i bought it i feel like it's useless mm. then i rinse my face with cold water and put more soap on my face just to make sure i get really deep into my pores with this face exfoliator and yeah then i just you know, make sure I get in there really good. You see that? Get it in there really good, Jasmine. Then I rinse my face. <laughs> then I rinse my face and then dry it off with a towel, a clean towel. I usually pat, but y'all see me ripping my skin. So next, I'm using this um, Witch Hazel by Dixon's. Is that what it says in the bottom? I don't know. But yeah, I made a cheat. I put cotton rounds in a, in a jar and I poured the, the Witch Hazel in the jar. That's the best way to do it if you lazy. See how I just grab one and just put it on my face? Yeah, I'm telling y'all, boy, y'all gotta, I'm putting y'all on some tips right now, okay? This is the holy grail right here, okay? Make sure y'all get y'all neck too, because y'all neck is a part of y'all face. Some of y'all neck be dirty. You see how I just picked up all that extra dirt? See, hey, get y'all some witch hazel cotton rounds. I'm telling y'all, boy, homemade. So next, this is what y'all been looking for, the Bio 7 Oil, bro. So many people are asking me about this. It may be good oil for other people. You know what I'm saying? But this... Uh-uh. No, nah. This? No. Okay, this oil made my skin have a rash on the side of my face. Y'all don't see the rash because I stopped using the oil like three weeks ago, three or four weeks ago. And my skin looks perfect as if the rash was never there. I'm trying to... I'm going to insert a video. But yeah, I switched back to the old cheap cocoa butter formula, whatever this is, Hill Softens. I use this. This is perfect. That bio skin, no. Uh, no, my skin was like, what is this? Get this off of me. I might try it in the winter though. I'm going to hit y'all up on that. So then I use my serum that I made for my eyebrows and my eyelashes because I'm growing my eyebrows out and my eyelashes are too. And it's working perfecto for me. So I look crazy. <laughs> I look crazy when I was putting that on. Look, oh God. <laughs> but yeah, 
I use that for my eyes and my eyelashes. That's how I get them so thick and dark. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.